right, guys. Let me put you there. We're in the garage. And I'm going to mow the lawn. It was a job that I was supposed to do two days ago. Didn't do it. Put it off. Put it off. But I'm doing it now. So it's looking really long. This is what it is like at the moment. Let's see how long this is. It's massive. But we've also got some really dry parts here too. The downside of mowing the lawn and all the dust is I'm filthy and now I need to change. I didn't really think this through because I've done my makeup. I really shouldn't have done it. Until after my shower. But hey ho. Maybe the, this is just kind of life's way of telling me I need to stay in tonight, get into my pyjamas and chill. I can do that. Look at Roxy, she's like licking the floor. Is that tasty? Rocks, rocks. Is that tasty? Is it? <laughs> Crazy! <laughs> yes, you are. hairdryer just broke. It's all dry underneath here but on top it's wet. <laughs> My hair might look greasy, but it's got it's got arrogant oil in my hair, um, so looks greasy, but it's not. Um, today, I was hoping to go out and do some wedding shopping with Gemma, but I got my period today, and yeah, I'm not going out today. So instead, what I'm doing is this. These are the two units that are in the hallway and I'm painting them with chalk paint. This is a winter grey. I want to keep it a kind of nice fresh colour in there because it's only a small space and don't want it to look cluttered or anything like that. So, And it's really hot painting in this weather. So I got this which is an instant cooling spray which we bought for Glastonbury. Um, didn't use too much there, but yeah, keeping me cool. Okay, I've finished painting them, so there they are. That's not too bad. I was expecting to need to do more coats than I did. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to secure them with these. They're like little bracket things. Oh, they're called mending plates. Um, they're only like 50p for two, so... I'm going to try my hardest to secure that now, so it's then one complete unit. This is what the shelving unit looks like now. As you can see, they have been hinged at the back to hold them in place just so that they don't come apart. I haven't hinged it here. Um, if it was something that I would be kind of moving around a lot, I probably would, and we do have more hinges. So if I need to move it, I can always put another hinge on. But it's going to stay here now. Um, and look, it looks really nice and it matches the gate as well. Which is pretty good. So now I just need to fill it. So that's finished. So we've got the umbrellas in just like a little Ikea flower pot. Then we've got flip-flops on the bottom. Um, just because shoes are kept upstairs. But if we want to... Walk outside in the garden, go out to the bin, they're easy to get hold of, need to put Charlie's down there. 
Then this basket here is Roxy and Socks's bits and pieces like poo bags, combs, balls. Better not say that word too loud for Roxy, otherwise she'll think she's going out. Then bag for lives and then festival hats. So there's space for kind of putting shoes in and other bits and pieces like guests if they come round. So what do you think? And look, who's here? It's Judy Bishop coming to do some more work. Hi! Right, I've just taken a little bit of a break to show you what's going on here. Judy is sanding down a ladder. Need to get painted later. And Charlie, what are you doing, Charlie? Spray painting. He's spray painting all of the jars, well, all of the tin cans. And he's doing a good job. And we've done a little bit of graffiti as well. So, Charlie's initials and my initials. Your initials as well, cover Just for a bit of fun. We've been spray painting a couple of jars. Look how nice they look. Fancy, eh? So we've actually started some big jobs for the wedding. Okay, this morning we have been to Moss Bros. Is that what it's called? I believe so. To get Chris's waistcoat. So we've got all the waistcoats sorted now. And we also went to see Dodo, which was nice. Plus, we just went to Ikea and bought loads of wedding bits and pieces too. And I only spent £40, which I think is pretty good. Now we're heading back to the house because we go to the beach hut. We need to pick up Charlie and his friend. Okay, we finally made it down to the beach and it's Sandfest 2017. This is what we're doing today. Look, there's so many people out on the sea. And we've been swimming and drinking and eating and yeah, we're having a good time. Mm -hmm. 